Sean P. Diddy Combs facing life in prison. Man, it's your boy, D. Snow from the GOAT. I'm back in the house for show. Hey, y'all know what it is. Shout out to the subscribers, man, to the followers. I love it. Hey, I know I've been going for a while, but your boy is back, and I'm bringing nothing but that hotness like I always do. And uh, from what we said, P. Diddy is cooked. You know what I'm saying? I made the funny video about the bottles of oil and things like that. But um, on a real note, looks like P. Diddy is in a lot of hot water, man. You know, um, everything that's happened over the last six months, we've all seen it. You know, the videos of Cassie. You know what I'm saying? The um, different lawsuits from the different people alleging different things. You know, they've been at Diddy's neck. And finally, the fans stepped in and said, that's enough. We're going to go ahead and, you know what I'm saying, slap them in these cuffs and throw them in the bang. And that's what they did. Um, um, from what we saw, no bail, you know what I mean? Um, you know, they're not trying to let him out, you know, just like with Bill Cosby, they're not going to play with him. You know what I mean? He, hey, he was take that, take that. And now he finna take that, take that. You know, it's, it's crazy how things, you know, like they say, you know, it's crazy, crazy how, you know, things come back around when you're not doing right by people. And, you know, I saw a post that they saying is about Boosie and I'm hoping it's not because Boosie usually stands on all 10 when it comes to the right things, but stays away when it's hot water. But he's saying, you know, that, you know, Diddy is getting prosecuted for the things that a lot of celebrities have done. And I truly believe that's true. They are out here doing the most. They are out here, like Rick Ross say, my, you know, all up in her champagne. She ain't even know it. You know, they is out here doing the most. And, and, and these girls, sometimes they, you know, with it, sometimes they not. Allegedly, you know, but... That's really how it goes out there. And that's why you got to be careful with the company you keep. You be careful who you leave your cup or your drink around. You got to know who you're dealing with because you never know what's going to come until you wake up the next day and, you know, either your throat feeling a little different or your cheeks don't feel as tight as they did. You know, allegedly. <laughs> but um, it's, it's not looking good for Diddy because the one thing we all know about the feds, they only come in when they got enough to really cook you and fry you. You know, they're not trying to play unless they're going to win. You know, they got over a 90%, you know what I'm saying, conviction rate. Because most, pe most people just cop out and take something and get it out the way. But we know Diddy got enough money. He's not going to lay down. He's not going to take this land down, I might say, and no pun intended. But um, he's going to fight. And um, this is probably going to be crazy. You know, it's going to be a lot. And um, it's in L well, we I didn't really see. I don't know if it was L.A. or New York. I think it's um, one or the other. But we know that, you know, it's going to be highly highly, you know, broadcasted and televised. And, you know, and, and we're going to all be front row seats for it to see what's really going to happen. But like I said, man, Diddy is facing life in prison. He's facing life in prison, you know, with all the allegations and all, everything, if he's convicted of everything, you know, he's looking at a lot of time, man. And, uh, I mean, let's see what happens, man. Let's see if um, Diddy, you know, takes it on the head and, take, you know, takes it on the chin. Or if he decides to, you know, start saying, well, you know, guess what I know? Guess what I got? Start letting the skeletons out the closet, you know? They saying his videos he got out there. You know, they saying it's all kind of stuff allegedly that he got against other people. So we'll see what happens. But um, hey, usually just one of them times I'll be like, man, shout out, man, prayers. Ooh. Hey, I ain't in that, man. If you out here hurting people, bro, I ain't gonna never support you or think that's cool. And you know, somewhere Tupac is smiling and having saying, hey, it's about time they got him. <laughs> no, nah, but uh man, hey. Y'all watch yourselves out there, man. Be careful with the company you keep and watch who you leave your drink around. Matter of fact, don't leave your drink around nobody. And sip along, smoke along. It's the best way to stay on your way home. Your boy D-Snow and I'm gone.